I missed you so I'm letting go of everything but you These are the good times with you Baby this Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, welcome to my channel. My name is Jenna and in today's video we are finally going to be decorating for Christmas. I am so excited to be sharing this video with you guys, and I am so excited that my house is finally decorated for Christmas. Christmas is my favorite time of the year. Now, I will say this is the earliest that we have ever decorated, but we only decorated this early because we just have a lot going on around Thanksgiving time, and I wanted the decorations to be up before December 1st, Plus, my husband, Zach, was also really excited, and he helped out a ton as well, along with the kids. Yeah, it's just gonna be you and me, hang by the fire and chill. Isn't this how it's supposed to be, making our Christmas memories, oh. And I've been longing to hold you close, forget about everyone else. Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories Oh oh La da 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 oh 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 La da 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 oh 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 La da 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 Making our Christmas memories I've been wrapping presents for you I've been hanging marbles in the tree And I've lit my house with Christmas lights So you should come back home to me up in the morning I'm gonna play those carols that you love We'll be singing all the melodies Until the sun comes up These are the good times with you Baby, this year It's just gonna be you and me Hang by the fire and chill Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories, oh And I've been longing to hold you close Forget about everyone else Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories, oh entertainment center was my favorite area to decorate last year and I will say it is one of my top areas as well this year just because it brings me so much happiness like seeing the lit up garland and I got that garland on a really good deal last year I feel like I got it for like 10 or 12 dollars at Walmart and I'm obsessed with it I wish I would have bought a few more because it is just such great quality garland I mean it's not super thick or anything but that is why I love all of these little add-ins that I had from Hobby Lobby last year. And then I put the little uh, lighthouse. And then I will also add a picture of Santa that lights up. So it just kind of makes it all come together. It's so good to see you again. To see you again. Baby, this year it's just gonna be you and me. Hanging by the fire chair. Of course, while we were decorating, we were watching The Santa Claus, which is one of my favorite all-time Christmas movies, and it was giving you guys a little bump shot, too, you know, of the progress and showing you my Mama Claus sweater 
that I got last year. But I want to know in the comments down below, what is one of your all-time favorite Christmas movies? Or give me like your top three. My favorite one that I just said is the Santa Claus movie. I absolutely love that movie with Tim Allen. Hold up, I am on my way. I'm in motion. Let's go to the ocean. Yeah, let's go outside. We can hang out on the beach without freezing. Yeah, isn't that amazing? In Christmas time. We'll be chilling and having a good, good time. Doesn't matter if the snow is. Last year we had our stockings, our tree, most of our Christmas decorations upstairs in our loft area. And it was really pretty and really nice. I loved it. The only downfall was that there was not a lot of room for us to open gifts upstairs. And we couldn't like really enjoy it and see each other. And there was like not a lot of space. So I am really happy that we decided to move everything downstairs just because it feels like Christmas all the time because we spend the majority of our time downstairs and I am loving how it turned out. I'm glad that I could hang the stockings there. It turned out perfect. Just come in to visit No, he wouldn't miss this In Christmas times Oh, and the sun said it is just get better On a blanket with the skyline painted in blue Ooh, yeah, that's what we do We'll be chilling and having a good, good time Santa's gonna come and join us in this song oh, yeah. I do have a few uh, Christmas tablecloths. I have this green one, I have a buffalo check, and then I believe I do have a red one. So this is gonna change like throughout the time until Christmas because obviously with young kids, they're gonna get stuff on them. And actually, as I am doing this voiceover, I already had to take the tablecloth off because Savannah spilled her drink on it. You know, that's just life with toddlers, that's how it is. So right now I do not have a tablecloth on it, but I will be getting one on it soon. Let's go outside, the snow is falling down And every child is having so much fun The snowman is twice the size as me With a smile as quirky as mine We're holding hands to keep each other warm While we stand and watch a choir perform And all the Christmas songs that we love Yeah, all the Christmas songs that we love and in a while we're gonna go inside and drink our chocolate by the fire Cause all I want is to spend this day with you
Let me give you a Christmas A moment we'll fill with love and joy Mm-mm, so beautiful Kissing on a mistletoe baby, with you I don't need any presents As long as I spend this day with you Mm-mm, so beautiful Kissing on a mistletoe baby, with you Making plans for what we're gonna do. I feel so blessed that I can be with you. God knows it. So as you see, the top of our fridge is just a cluttered mess with so much random junk up there. And I told Zach, let's go ahead, let's clean up the top of the fridge, let's make it festive, and that way it'll be clean and look super cute as well. I've been longing for you, I just wanna hold you close. You know the stars are shining just for you Let's take a walk and we can follow the moonlight Till we reach a place we can stay Maybe kiss a bit and dream away And in a while we're gonna go inside And drink our chocolate by the fire Cause all I want is to spend this day with you Let me give you a Christmas A moment we'll fill with love Kissing on a mistletoe, baby, with you I don't need any presents As long as I spend this day with you mm -mm, So beautiful Kissing on a mistletoe, baby, with you And drink our chocolate by the fire Cause all I want is to spend this day with you Let me give you a Christmas A moment we'll fill with love and joy Love and joy. so beautiful Kissing on a mistletoe, baby, with you With you, with I don't you. need any presents As long as I spend this day with you a little fun fact the tree right there that is on top of the fridge was actually uh, given to me from my grandma and I absolutely love it I love Christmas decorations that are just passed on through family and I love like the traditional colors yes as you see I have a lot of buffalo check but this as well the calendar is a Christmas family tradition as well. It was my dad's as a kid and every, you know, day of the month we go ahead and we put a little ornament on the tree and I just love stuff like that. Like I'm just a huge sentimental person so I love that and I also love traditions and we are creating our own traditions in our family which I love as well. So we have a few different things that we started doing but let me know in the comments down below what Christmas traditions you have been implementing in your family or that you have kept as you grew up. Last year I thought about how things can So we were going to put the tree over here. These are the, the bins from us decorating and such. But as you see, there's not a lot of room between the table and the wall. So it's not really going to work out there. 
And then if you come over here, we can't really move it too much because it's still like a really narrow way. So that's why we put the chair in the office, move this down, and we're going to put the Christmas tree right here. So it's in front of a window because we want it in front of a window. And I think it's going to go really well. It's not going to need that much space, but, you know, we just want space while we're setting it up and decorating it. On my way. Let me just say I absolutely love our fake tree but the only thing that stinks every year with decorating and doing the tree is spreading all of the branches apart and my daughter Savannah really wanted to help and she kind of helped a little bit and then she kind of got sick of it and also Zach was a huge help as well and I had to sit down periodically throughout just because it was a lot and I had to do it on time lapse because this took a really long time. It is a big tree, it is a tall tree, but I'm just really happy with how it turned out. Plus it is pre-lit. I highly recommend pre-lit trees because putting lights on a tree just stresses me out because I am just such a perfectionist. Like I want it to look good and I am just so bad at it. So I learned my lesson to definitely get a pre-lit tree. This is our second year using this tree and I love it. I am so happy with it. Zach said in the future that he wants to get like a snowy fake tree and I told him okay yeah but we're not getting a another tree for a long time like this one needs to last us a lot more years we gather around the fireplace and no one cares about yesterday Every time the snow is falling down and it is cold outside, we gather around the fireplace and no one cares about yesterday. While we were decorating, Maverick was obsessed with all of the ornaments, especially like the round ones. He thought they were balls and that he could play with. And I'm sure that you guys are seeing he's like bouncing them on the floor and none of them broke. They are really pretty good ornaments because they did not break with him. And he's doing a really good job staying away from the tree. There have been a couple of times he says ball and he like pulls off an ornament or whatever. But then we put it back on with him. So he's doing a really good job. Savannah got really into decorating the tree this year. So I just had to leave all of this footage in because it was just a lot of fun and I know I'm going to look back on this in a couple of years and it's just going to warm my heart because they just grow so fast. Like when you really think about it, you don't get a lot of Christmases with your kids at home, especially when they're little and growing up and, you know, believing in the magic of Christmas and... I just love it. So I had to keep it in there. It was a lot of fun and I really enjoyed decorating the tree with my family.
Christmas A time for miracles Wishing To find a remedy Hoping For better days To come Memories Are flickering Shadows Cold nights Hearing the wind blows The snowflakes Reminds me loft area that I was talking about right above where I'm kind of standing that is where we had our tree and all of our decorations last year and I did have my uh like my staircase and whatnot decorated with lights and I thought it was super magical so I had to do it again this year and I am so glad that I did granted I don't have any decorations upstairs but I love that it carries on the downstairs and you know you just get that Christmas feeling and especially on Christmas morning when we go downstairs and all of the lights are on and you turn and then you're gonna see the Christmas tree it is just gonna be so magical and it already is magical I absolutely love it I wake up so happy in the morning with my Christmas lights on like it just makes me so happy let me know in the comments down below if you guys feel the same way about your christmas decorations but that is going to be it for today's video i really hope that you enjoyed it and you liked seeing all of our christmas decorations because they are going to be in all of my videos up until a little bit after christmas so make sure you hit that like button if you like today's video and subscribe if you want to i usually post twice a week with the occasional bonus video and i can't wait to see you guys in the next one bye so